Hey guys. Hi guys. So we recently saw that Swamp Thing is getting a scented pop. Which could be a bad thing and a good thing. Some people think it's absolutely stupid. Some people think it's actually really cool. To me, I think it makes sense only because, you know, a lot of toys used to have scented. I think it's interesting because when, you know, when you were kids, you have those big bubble scratch and sniff stickers that you used to get from your yeah. teachers and they were like the greatest thing ever. I know with my sister, she had a lot of like the strawberry shortcake scented things yes. and My Little Pony. Yep. So those were huge. So I think it only makes sense that some of these pops that like kids would play with. And of course, as adults, we're going to collect them. But as a kid, they want to play with them. I think it makes sense. So we thought, hey, what could be some good variant flavors? So here we go. We're going to give you our list. All right. So number one, I was thinking Ninja Turtles that smell like pizza. Oh my God. I never even thought of that. That'd be really funny. <laughs> You'd have to have a Mikey with like a really cheesy slice. Ooh, that'd be awesome. I thought for sure if you're gonna have Pumpkin King, he should smell like a pumpkin. So. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> I thought idea. that'd be really like, good. Like, well, your pumpkin pie or pumpkin spice? Just a pumpkin. Just like, like a, just like fall like flavors. Like when you're cutting a pumpkin, that smell. That would be good. Just like like an that'd be a good Halloween or like a maybe. Oh, there's so many good flavors during Thanksgiving. I know. Like well, a Ralphie, well, like a bunny no, suit Ralphie with turkey. I turkey said flavor? turkey flavored Christmas story. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so my next one would be Bob's Burgers Bob, but he should he should smell like a cheeseburger. That's true. I didn't even <laughs> think about that. That'd be funny. Also, I think another good one would be Slimer, but he would he would like smell like, and I don't know how licensing would work, but he would smell like the high C Slimer juice. Do you remember that when you were a kid? No. I don't so know. a long time ago, they used to have green high C in the little like kids boxes that you would you know juice suck box? through. Yeah, little yeah. juice box. And they had a, the Slimer one. I think that'd be a cool, like, scent. I don't know if anybody would get it. They'd be like, I don't understand the smell. Yeah, but. I was thinking maybe if he smelled like sewage or something because he's green and sewage <laughs> is gross. So I thought that's where you were going with that. I think a good one would be like a candy scented Vanellope from um, Wreck It Ralph. I said that. <laughs> Did you really? Yes. I thought that'd Perfect. be great. I was thinking, yes, candy or maybe even peppermint. Recently, Penguins came out last year for San Diego Comic Con with the cheese puffs in his hand. Mm -hmm. I think it would be kind of be cool to have that for same sure. one, but it smelled like cheese puffs. That'd be good. There's a little special place in my heart for Toy Story. It was the first, like, thing that blew my mind when I was a kid as far as animation goes. And uh, a wood smell, a wood scented Woody. I mean, it would make sense. That'd be kind of funny, yeah. <laughs> or maybe like gunpowder. Oh, even better. Gunpowder would be much <laughs> yeah. better. I think a peppermint Santa would be really good. Peppermint or, Santa. I mean, peppermint is synonymous with Christmas and so are poinsettias. So yeah. some kind of a flavor or like spruce, smell that way. Like, yeah. like, the tree, like a Christmas tree. Yeah, that would Ooh, be good. A Christmas me. tree scented yeah. Santa. That'd be really That'd be awesome. awesome. I think an ocean scented Ariel would be kind of cool. Oh, yeah. Like, the, like the cool breeze or whatever yeah. candle that you get. <laughs> Make yeah. it smell like the ocean breeze. <laughs> I personally have like a disease. Every time I walk past a candle aisle, I'm just like, smell, smell, smell. It takes smell, me like smell, 30 smell. minutes to get him away from the candle <laughs> aisle. It's awful. I gotta smell them all. And I'm like, just leave them alone. Now, Simpsons, my favorite television show of all time, probably. Uh, we do have Bart, which you said yesterday. This is my idea. Bart, and he'll smell like Butterfinger. Perfect. That Isn't would that be great? amazing. But how about Homer? And he would probably smell like a donut. Duff beer. Or Duff beer. But what about <laughs> Duff Man? Duff Man smells Duff like Duff Man beer. smells like Duff, Duff beer. Man. <laughs> <laughs> you do a lot of Simpsons. They could smell like a lot of things. Yeah, I think those for would be sure. really fun. I think we should have some Harry Potter characters that smell like butter beer. I mean, that's just makes sense. Yeah. Or a fire whiskey. That'd be kind of cool too. What about chocolate for the chocolate frogs? Yeah, that'd be awesome. Neville mm -hmm. with his chocolate frogs. That would be great. I think Luna would be great with the radish smell because of her radish earrings. Well, that would be a weird fun. smell, wouldn't it? Doesn't, yeah. doesn't radish kind of stink a little bit? I don't know. I, I don't, don't even really know if this has a one. smell to it, really. I don't know. I don't know. Scooby Doo, that smells like Scooby Snacks. I mean, come on now. Yeah, I think that one is like the uh, most obvious one. Yeah, for sure. We keep hearing that, yeah, we saw some Scooby Doo dorbs coming out, but if they do have a pop line, which I've heard they do have a pop line coming, <sighs> a Scooby Snack. I, I don't know what a Scooby Snack even smells like. They sell them in the store. I've seen them at Meyer in the cookie aisle. They could make it up. It doesn't yeah, really matter. I mean, but if it did smell like, like a dog biscuit, oh my God, that would be like one of the best variants. That, that would be, be the best variant, my opinion. That would be better than Flock. That would be better than anything because it would make more sense to me if I was a collector for a scented Scooby Snack, Scooby Doo, than a Flock. What if it was Flocked and scented? I mean. Okay, so how about this one? And I, I don't think you know this one, and I didn't tell you this one, but I think this one would be really cool. Which you don't know any of, because we, this is my list, and I, you have a list, but... <laughs> how about the Flintstones, and they smell like Fruity Pebbles? That would be so funny! Yes. Oh my god, that would be great! Uh, that would be awesome! Or Stay Puff, and you would smell like Marshmallow. I wouldn't even have thought of that, but pretty that's, obvious. that's pretty obvious. I mean, 
that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> okay, here's one that I had a lot of fun with, okay? A show that I used to watch when I was a kid and I loved it was Beavis and Butthead. Now, I don't know, did you watch a lot of Beavis and Butthead when you were a kid? My mom would not let me watch very much ah. Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> well, I wouldn't let my mom know. I watched a lot of Beavis and Butthead, and what was, the main thing that, that they loved was nachos. So they ate nachos all the time, so I think like a cheesy <laughs> nacho scented Beavis and Butthead would be extraordinary. That'd be funny. <laughs> now, for you, being that you're scared of clowns, how about a Captain Spaulding or it that would smell like cotton candy? That just creeped me out. That would be scary. A horror or one balloons, that would smell like cotton candy. Balloons. They're like the latex oh. rubber smell. No. That would be kind of scary. That would be terrifying. <laughs> and then kind of the most obvious line I think that's getting that's coming out now and some more to come is Willy Wonka. So Willy Wonka, you'd have like Violet that would smell oh like blueberry. Oh my gosh. You'd have maybe, uh, who's the one that fell in the chocolate pond or whatever? Augustus. Augustus. You could have Augustus smell like chocolate. Augustus or, oh, Yeah. You could have them all because they all... You had some sort of flavor going on in yeah, the movie, you definitely so could. you could just follow that whole line. It'd be really, really fun. Like that'd be really cool. I think an interesting one could be the Fast and the Furious line and make them smell kind of like car grease or something. Car grease, that'd yeah, be like, kind of cool. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah, like like a car, like that car like, smell. The they have the mechanics, like you know, new car on. smell. Uh, grease, oil, yes. gas, yep. you could do all, burnt rubber, all of that. you could do all of it. <laughs> you could also do penguin and you could smell like fish. Now those were kind of our ideas, just some baseline ideas, but we did see some community ideas that I saw on our Facebook that I thought were really fun ideas and I want to read them now, that way you can kind of see that how awesome some of these ideas were. One that I really liked was Biff from Back to the Future where he's driving his car and he runs into the manure truck. Oh. So a Biff scented manure or whatever, that would be hilarious. Biff that smells like poo. <laughs> <laughs> Another one that I thought was a great idea. Um, it's 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 a subtle idea, and maybe a lot of people would understand it. A Joker that would smell like pudding because of yes! Harley. Yes, <laughs> that would be awesome. That would be so funny, and then we could have a Harley holding like a pudding cup and just kind of looking at him Ooh, longingly. That would this be is great. a great idea because you know how they did the Valentine's Day Harley yeah, last year, where it could he's be a two pack. Came? Next Valentine's Day, you could really do like chocolate scented. Well, chocolate pudding, sin, and Joker, or whatever. That'd be kind of yeah, cool. Yeah, that'd be really cute. Now, another one that we saw was Garbage Pail Kids. Oh, God. Smelling like, you could say garbage, but every one of them has their own little thing, like boogers and garbage. And yeah, grossness. Just gross. But what if we had Oscar the Grouch? I'm just throwing this in there, and he smelled, Oscar, <laughs> he trash. smelled like a trash can. Like wet can. trash. <laughs> Nobody would want to buy it, though. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> but yeah, Garbage Pail Kids, with all those different flavors gross. and all those different problems, that would be like more... Maybe in the line of like mystery minis, like bring the mystery minis yeah, back out. Yeah, that would out. be a great mystery. That'd be set. fun. Scented mystery minis. Because you could open some of them and just gag and set it to the side. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> now one that I, I found hilarious, and I don't think they could do it, but maybe I don't know how scents and, and licenses work. I don't know if you can't do this, or whatever. But Macho Man and Slim Jims. Oh my God! Yes, that, that has awesome. to happen. That would be that awesome. Is, like hold one to snap into a Slim Jim. Snap into a Slim Jim. <laughs> Another obvious one that somebody did mention on, on Facebook was Deadpool, and he would smell like a chimichanga or possibly tacos. Oh my God! On which yes. One. You know, I think with the scented ones, it'd be nice though to maybe do the paint jobs a little different. You know, don't don't make it exactly yeah. the same thing with like a scent. Maybe you have fun with it. Like if you're gonna make say Deadpool smell like tacos, make his paint job look like a taco shell or something crazy. I was crazy. totally just thinking Yeah, that. just something awesome. Just out, off the wall. If you're going to be off the wall with flavors, be off the wall with the, with the Go colors Go all too. out. Another one was Cookie Monster. Smell like cookies. I think that's kind of an obvious yep, one. Yep, definitely. Now, here's the one. That, number one, I think they should be pops. I love they were pops. Um, King of the Hill. King of the Hill would be oh, awesome pops. Oh, yeah. But Hank Hill and he smell like propane. Oh my god. <laughs> that is a great idea. That's I love hilarious. that. That's yeah. like amazing. I like that one. And then finally, now if you're a Funko fan and you've been around for a little while, you know that Funko was really big into cereal, uh, cereal mascots. Now I think they could expand that line and just have all kinds of them, but they would all smell like their corresponding cereal flavors. I think that'd be a perfect idea. I mean, think of all the ones. Like, I think like a Lucky Charm would be amazing. And it would smell like kind of like marshmallows. Yeah. You, know? uh, you could do. I don't know. You could do Tony the Tiger, but does does Corn Flakes really have a smell? Maybe just sugar. Yeah, maybe. Like a sugar smell. And kind of like the Trix Rabbit. Trix is a good smell, actually. Yeah. I think Trix really smells good. good. <laughs> like, remember the Trix popsicles? Yeah. That I do. smell, like inside of a pop, would be. Oh man, that'd be rough for me because that's like a really good flavor to me. <laughs> I'd be like, I don't want to eat this, but yeah. Do you remember um, the mascot for Cookie Crisp that used to be the two burglars? Yes. <laughs> I, that always reminded me of the McDonald's, the burglar or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah hamburger. Yeah, they look kind of alike. Yeah, mm -hmm. that would be kind of cool. That'd be a good I would one. like to see. I don't know why, because I, I don't know how it is in other countries for you that are watching in other countries. In America, cereal is kind of like a childhood 
uh, it's like the first time you're able to pick what you want. Like, yeah. like as a dip, like a variant or it's whatever. Like dessert for breakfast. It's the great. You have all these different flavors and all these different mascots, and they bombard American kids. I'm sure Canadian and North American kid with like whatever the mascot is. Hey, try me. I'm yeah. I'm a rabbit. Or hey, try well, me. I'm the great a... thing is like especially with like tricks. It's like um, something about you silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. And yeah, I, I'm sorry, but tricks are for adults. <laughs> <laughs> but see, that's the point though. You grow up and you have a connection to cereal and you have a connection to those mascots. I think cereal mascot pops are cool and I think to make them yeah, be scented like their cereal is a whole new level of those. There, there's just a, an overwhelming amount of nostalgia with cereal I think. Absolutely. And so if, if they did that and they kept the scents with them boy that'd be that'd be a win for me. Mm -hmm. So that is some of the variants maybe we'd like to see for scents. Let us know what you guys think about this whole new idea of Funko with scents. I know I saw a lot of people out there say that you know, maybe this is enough. Stop making all the different variants. And, mm -hmm. and I do agree with you at a certain point, but I think scented pops is a whole new level of variants, and I think that's okay. I think it's possible maybe we should stop seeing the same variants of like, you've got your metallic. Really, we don't see a whole lot of metallic. Not but anymore. But uh, glow in the dark, black and white. Flocked. Bl yeah, flocked. Uh, which, you know, we like it depending on what it is. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, kind of your basic repaint of the same thing. I'm um, glad that we're getting a different type of variant, a different yeah. version, so that it's not just the same thing, wash, rinse, repeat over and yeah, over again. Yeah, yeah. And uh, that's kind of how it's been for a little while now. Mm -hmm. you know? Now, we're guilty buying them. <laughs> that's not oh, saying we don't yeah, buy them. Time. But you know how it is. <laughs> if you're collectors, you know what I'm talking right. about. All right, guys. So put in the comments down below what kind of variant scented pop that you would like to see, what you're thinking. Do you think scented pops are kind of cool, or do you think they're kind of, eh, you're not quite sure? And we'll Let us leave them in the box. This has to be one that comes out yeah. of the box, right? Ooh, bing, ding, ding, idea. What? The exclusive sticker should be a scratch and sniff. Ah, uh, yeah, it should. Yeah. All right, that's <laughs> enough amazing ideas for that's one great. day. We'll see you guys next Thank time. Thank you guys. Bye. Bye.